obviously it's going to be a nursery, but you know how I am when it comes to color. So if it's a girl's nursery, I love the idea of not doing the obvious, but pink. I want pink. I would love pink. That's, I know. Kind of pink I know from. it's so obvious, but, but when you say pink, like just any pink, like, like muted pink or what if I were like crazy hot pink? Muted. Like I think a tea party pink would be ideal. Tea party pink. Mm -hmm. I think your goal, if I could ask you to do something, you know me well enough, I want to cry when I walk in. I want You cry at everything. I know, but <laughs> I want I want You're not, like I could say something in the next like sentence and you'll make you cry. What makes you the most emotional about being pregnant with twin girls? It's just it's everyone's dream come true. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. It's just this whole thing feels um genuinely feels too good to be true. So the whole time we've been kind of nervous and we've recently shifted from cautiously optimistic to getting full blown excited. And even just talking about this makes it tangible, makes it on the horizon to be something they're actually gonna be coming home and be out of here. So that's just, um, it's surreal to think about. We really had gotten to a point last year where we thought we might never be so blessed again to have another child. So we've been so focused on just keeping them safe in their healthy growing that we haven't had time to really think about the fun part of it. So we definitely need Brian's help so when we do finally bring them home, there's a safe, beautiful, fun place for them to, to rest.